The lion is a muscular, deep-chested cat with a short, rounded head. Of the living felid species, the lion is rivaled only by the tiger in length, weight, and height at the shoulder. In Africa, the range of the lion originally spanned most of the central rainforest zone and the Sahara Desert. The Cape Buffalo is the typical subspecies, and the largest one, found in southern and east Africa. It is widely regarded as one of the most dangerous animals on the African continent. And according to some estimates it gores, tramples, and kills over 200 people every year. Lions always attack in a pack, never individually. A lone lion would stand little chance against a fully grown adult cape buffalo which weighs half a ton, has a super powerful kick and horns which can pierce the lion's skin and puncture vital organs. Lions therefore generally go for the old, sick adults or calves. Even if they are running away instead of fighting, the buffalo are hard to kill. Typically, it's taking a good-sized lion pride to take them down. That isn't even taking into account what the buffalo can do to lions. The buffalo's horns won't kill a lion outright, but they're so powerful that they can easily fling lions into the air. Either outcome will cause a significant amount of damage in addition to the wound caused by the horn. There have been reports of single lions killing full-grown buffalo, but most prides fail to kill the adults. One lion attempting it would almost certainly be go red and die as a result of the wound. The male cape buffaloes are known for their bad temper. When a calf was set upon by three or four lions, then the entire herd of buffalo grouped and charged them. The lions had to retreat.
A couple of male lions did try another attempt but had to retreat as well. In some cases, the majority of the lions were able to flee, but one unfortunate lion was cornered. After that, things go downhill for the lion. It's being cornered by a many angry male cape buffaloes, who are tossing it up into the air, butting and kicking it. In such an encounter, lions are occasionally killed. One of the most common places for one animal to attack another is a watering hole. Because most animals require water, this is an ideal location for predators to wait and wait for their prey to come to them when they are hungry. Crocodiles and other large water-dwelling animals will swoop down and grab animals that lean down to drink. They'll kill and eat almost anything they can get their hands on, including fish, deer, and buffalo. They tear chunks off with their teeth and swallow them whole. Buffaloes are the most common prey of hyenas. With their powerful jaws, they can tear buffalo bones, allowing them to break bones that even a lion couldn't. Because calves' defenses are still weak, hyenas usually prey on them. Adult buffalo will usually come to help, so they must kill the calf quickly. Adult buffalo, particularly aggressive buffalo, are extremely dangerous and can kill or injure a large number of hyenas. If the hyenas are starving, they will attack the adult buffalo as well. they will pursue the buffalo until it becomes exhausted and falls down. The hyenas would then attack one by one, tearing it apart.
Please like this video and subscribe to BV Animal Documentary for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.